Hello everyone, Dickfig here, and welcome to another Borderlands 3 Let's Play video. Now, we left off with me being a little flustered, because I fucked up my recordings, and kind of screwed up the whole damn thing. And then I got frustrated at freaking One Punch here for not dropping this darn shotgun. So, before I started this episode, I came over here and I killed him one more time, and he done dropped it. Now this thing, it's so hard, it is ridiculous, and it is such a fun gun to use during your playthrough. I highly recommend farming him for it if you're going to do a playthrough. It just does insane damage if you know how to aim with it. It, is, it acts like a slug shotgun, but it doesn't have any spread on it. You just have to hold it over the target, pull the trigger, and usually they die for the next like four or five levels. It has a 50% chance not to consume ammo, which helps make this thing just even more ridiculous, as you guys can see here. And uh, he's not that hard to farm. There's a spawn point where you just... Apparently my aim is going to be really off today. That's going to be a thing. We, we can figure that out though. I can get better at the aiming. I say that every episode. I have been practicing offline. Quite a bit actually. Kind of embarrassed that I let it get so bad after so long. I used to be pretty damn good at it. Speaking of which, he just shoots and he misses. There we go. Oh, I don't do too bad. I know the movement in this game is very erratic of enemies, so I'm not like too concerned about it. There we go. Now, what makes this thing so ridiculous is that when it doesn't consume ammo, which is a 50% chance not to, you can just shoot it again. So there's chance where you can just spam shoot this thing, like right there. I shot three at a time instead of reloading. It only has a magazine size of one. And we are supposed to be doing quest objectives, so I need to hit the end of this road and take a right. I hear you behind me, little guy. Now this entire arena is nuts. There's just enemies everywhere, non-stop. You could fight in here for like hours and not get through it. So I'm gonna be trying to run past some of the mobs, thin them out a little so they don't actually kill me. But I will definitely be not fighting everything for this place, you guys, because I mean, it would take forever. Be like 16 let's play episodes just for this one area which it might be anyways because there's a lot of quests here this place truly has a lot of content i actually really like this arena too i think it's pretty good Whoa. now i do disagree with the way some of these things respawn now i was hoping that melee would kill her but it didn't what's up girl you got a rock launcher, I got a shotgun. My shotgun does more damage, but I mean, maybe you should have got some better gear, like a Jacob's rock launcher or something. Well, I tried to take that snapshot, it didn't work. The trimmer, dude, so you're selling yourself, Harry man? Come on now. All fighting over for your Harry Bush. That's information you should probably keep to yourself, buddy. Jeez. Walls. Jeez, make a ton of his penis size. What we do win video games. Apparently, I just sang a penis size song. Isn't that kind of weird? I think it's weird as fuck. Sometimes you never know where it's gonna take you, right? Just dick size singing songs for people on the internet. That's happening. It says there's a quest up here. Um, I see where I need to go. I, whoever's shooting at me, you're gonna die. Terrible death. Is that within range of you? Yes, it is. I am with some style. Nope, probably not the way I needed to go, but darn it, I jumped for it. You never know. Ooh. I love how the fans like cheer and everything. There's a whole bunch of fans. You guys know you can kill them. And they blow up in little bits. Uh, Random fact, you can kill all the audience members in these. Let's, let's see if we can figure out where we're headed up here. Ah, touche ladder, touche. You done bested me the once. Another ladder. Oh, I thought I missed that. That was really close. Hey, what the hell is Moxie's crew doing? Get You're stealing your batteries. That's fine. Right it's fine. It's roof camping. That's a thing in Battle Royales, right? It's a thing in every game. It's got to be a thing in this. But we have a whole bunch of other quests in here. We're gonna actually... Proof of Wife. Run over this hideout. Do some of the side quests before we finish a main quest. That is how you should quest in zones, usually. 
pretty sure I can cut through up here. What level are these? Better guns? 13s? Yeah, they're better. Don't really need another shotgun, not gonna lie. So we'll stick with the purple assault rifle at the end there. Oh, it's like M60 feeling gun. I dig that. This wants me to go down in the basement. This way. Not by basement, I mean sewers. Back down to where we actually got the shotgun from, but a little bit farther down the sewers. We have a bunch of cop robots chilling outside of the door. I think we went and actually saw it in the last video. But I didn't actually go in there. I run in the wrong way. On here. Need to get on the tracks and take a right. This combobulated there for a second, folk. Sometimes I just do random voices, guys. You're gonna have to deal with them. Sometimes I turn country and I say like y'all and folk, and I'm just, I have no idea why. I'm from the Northeast. I've grown up here. I live here. I was born up here. No self. Whoa. A little bit aggressive on your guy. Whoa, I can take his head clean off. Apparently, him blowing up killed his buddy. Not a problem, man. Shoot out so many pills with the shield. It's ridiculous. Pressing button. So here's the deal. I'm holding an Atlas soldier hostage. But I'll exchange her with you free, my girl Bloodshine. The cop bots got her. And I got her locked up in some stupid jail. Good voice acting for her. Not gonna lie. Arm thing's kind of lame. Could have done without that. Still feel like it's a Half-Life reference, and I don't super think it works very well in this game. But. They use it too many times. I think there's better things you could do for doorbell cams or for video screens. Missed. Oh, badass. You can have a grenade too while you're at it. You're a badass. Well, we got cycle badass too. We're gonna be in a little bit of trouble here. Put on my try hard pants. You missed. Oh, and then I missed. Didn't miss that shot though. Oh, we juked. Down. Tried to snap shoot it. I'm not good at snapshots. There we go. So the key to aiming is do it as slow as you need to until you can guarantee hits, even if it looks silly and stupid and feels really slow. Then you slowly speed it up. It looks good and faster. But you just want consistency in your hits before you change your speed. Or freaking side quests. Oh, you want me to find a dirty cop? Hot. Me, I'm not out here. Yeah, we got some murders about to happen out here. Thanks for opening the door, suckers. Picture. I want to be uh... Here's why there's still police stations and robots and people trying to can, like make people forced by the law in an underground combat arena. Kind of random. I also had an itch on my arm there. So now I'm on the ground crawling for my life. Because I decided to itch my arm mid combat. Because I don't like these shield bots. They're way too beefy. Especially when you don't have an electric weapon this early in the game. Take cover! Ooh, then right off your head. He's making that shield on the ground. I'm gonna call him the mech here, because I don't use it enough, and it is fun. Oh yeah, I have homing rockets on this thing. We're kind of in like a little hallway here. I say hallway, but with this thing on the roof here, that's what I'm looking for. The words I'm looking for is that there's a roof here. It's really, really fucking with the explosives. gonna kill herself. We want to kill you. Thank you. Next. Kill you though.
Yeah, fine then. I'll kill you then. Yes. Yes, I did. She's dead though. But I found her. She just doesn't need to know that she's dead, right? Way down right finds here? out you killed Bloodshine, I'm a goner. Nice. But I've got an idea. Grab her mask. Oh, you suck, game. Make me run all the way back up here. That is what we call uncalled for a darn game. Fine though. You can pretend it's fine. It's really fine. We'll be going away this weekend, guys, but I will be trying to get at least two episodes up for you guys. One for Saturday, one for Sunday. Some family stuff to go to. This does not happen very often because my family does not get together all that often. But this is one of those rare occasions where we are. We're heading out. Meet them up in New York. It'll be a good time, hopefully. Up there, can I actually open these ones? Interesting. Never opened all these cages. Is there any more? Oh, there are more. Now I'm like achievement hunting, cause like I know this isn't gonna be a thing. Just wanna open them all, darn it. Booth man sounds ridiculous. But as I was saying, in, in short, you guys shouldn't be missing anything. You shouldn't miss any episodes as long as I stick to my guns and do things ahead of time. It's actually, I'm not, I don't know the best track record with it, but I'm trying to get better at it. I'm trying to make a huge push here, cause both channels are growing. This channel's growing a lot faster than I thought it was. Because uh, previously, Let's Play channels of mine do not do very well. But I guess it does help when you have a channel that's kind of blowing up. To help push traffic this way. Kind of cool, and I really do appreciate you all stopping by here. I don't think I say that enough to you guys, because I should. Because it does mean a whole lot. You need to go down. You gotta go down, down. You know, there was a down, down back there where... We were, and I was kind of halfway down it, and then I realized I had to go back and get the mask, and then I didn't use it this time. That's how good of a player I am, guys. But this is what I was talking about. This place respawns quite frequently, so like it gets kind of it's not difficult. It's almost like it gets tedious to some extent, where you're just re-clearing the same areas over and over again. Like we've already cleared this once. Here we are again. And the enemies again, but they are a good practice for my aim, which I okay, desperately need to work on. So I want to look better. By, the door. by, by far. To fool them into letting you in. Be able to do like sick 180 trick shots on first try, even though I know how many tries those videos usually take. I have played those games enough to know that you just send it and hope to God it hits, and when it does hit, you're bam, you got a clip. A good clip too, usually. Yes, I did. Scrub. Now you're both dead. At least you got in. We'll talk after the bloodbath. There will be a bloodbath. Don't worry, I'm coming, I'm coming. I got you, I got you. We're here. I remember correctly, there's actually quite a few enemies on this one. They're kind of hefty. They might not be hefty when I have this gun. Because this gun. We're in the easy mode. That's why I keep telling you guys, it is definitely worth farming. Hands down. Makes your whole playthrough a way smoother. It does remove some of the challenge, unfortunately, but it's still fun enough. As I'm sitting there calling for my life, saying it removes all the challenge, and I shouldn't talk. I do not see you through your own freaking smoke and fog that you make from shooting that damn rocket launcher, you bastard. In a second, wind myself off your face. There we go. Kind of worried I wasn't actually going to. He just kill himself? No, okay, he just threw himself up in the air. Now he officially killed himself. Blew himself to Kingdom Come. Gonna dodge some rockets here. While getting hit in the face by a psycho, though. We got guys coming from all sides. Run across and not make it across. And just feel like idiots. I tried sliding too. Show me your head, dude. Wow, is she gonna, he's gonna be a bastard, isn't he? Pretty sure there's a psycho right behind me. I could have killed two that whole time. But I really, really wanted to risk it all for that guy's head. But shot to mother. Okay, that's why she hits so hard, because she's like the actual big bad. 
Bad chicken. Oof, I missed. There we go. Okay. Thank you all for appreciating. You know, thank you all for staying here and watching me be bad with Amy. And her mom. And work on it. More people with rock launchers? Dang people. Yeah, I kind of killed everyone. Sorry. But you did fuck with the Vault Hunter. When a Vault Hunter shows up, if you don't got good intentions, you should either just play along or ask them kindly to leave and hope they really don't have an interest in what you're doing. Because this is what happens. Our legend is for a reason. Now that you got me out, it's time to tell you that my full name is Naoko Katagawa. Yeah, my dickbag brother had all my siblings murdered by Tyrene Calypso. I'm the only one left. I see. Just so you know, I'm not like my brother. Dude's a psychopath, and he definitely wants me dead. I'm sure he does. As soon as I realized what my brother was doing, I tried to disappear on Promethea, found a dead Atlas soldier, and stole his gear. Then I got captured by the COV. Yeah, it didn't seem to I do very well. I got to for a while. Most people around here would kill me just for my last name. But if you see my brother, put a bullet in that dickbag's head. Will do. Just you, ma'am. Oh, and Tumor had stole a family heirloom of mine. I don't want it anymore, so it's all yours, Vault Hunter. No offense, but I hope I never see you again. Seriously. Honestly, it's probably a good call to never see me again. When I show up, people tend to die. In bulk. Like a really hefty bulk. Not gonna lie. We do some bulk death sales up in this mofo. Find the Atlas operative. Is not what the quest I want is. Game. Wish it would just stay sorted by area. Portal prison. Speak to Trash Melt's crew. Got it. Headed to the crew. Got to get a guy out of a porta potty that I cannot open with a shotgun that shoots slugs or explosives or you know any other absolutely ridiculous things I have on my character like acid grenades. It's all those porta potties are meant to last. I guess, kind of technically, they would have to be built like that to survive in uh, Pandora. We are not on Pandora, so maybe, I guess, I don't know, I don't know. I guess I have to survive on Pandora, because Pandora is an absolute, I want to say shit show, just to be uh, funny with words, but uh, yeah, porta potties would be destroyed so quickly on Pandora, it's not even funny. I hate these fucking shield guys. Like, Fucking lay off the damn shield. Killing them by just shooting them in the hands is absolutely obnoxious in this game. And when you're playing by yourself, there's no way to rotate them. Yet, spray paint. Spray paint. Spray paint. Spray paint. Spray paint. someone's breaking stuff upstairs. Spray paint can't acquire. It'll be fine. At least you have a place to go to the bathroom. It would absolutely suck to be trapped in a porta potty. Though. Let me out right now. They're like known for selling, smelling like terrible, but like in all honesty, they just smell like that fucking chemical that blue shit in like serious bulk. I guess I've never been in one that's like super old or like stuck in the heat for like a month without being cleaned out so I'm guessing they get pretty fucking nasty. And last the shit out of this mofo. Be war to you, what the fuck? You. What? Where are these guys coming from? This is her crew. Is she one of the contestants that's meant to hunt me? I don't know what it feels like. Where'd the Wixie guy go? I'm guessing that was her teleporting right behind me with a freaking stun baton. She's dead. Just drop anything cool? Oh. Up oh, grenades to a homing grenade though. 10 out of 10, do support that. Love me some homing grenades. 
Collect AI chip. Man, I thought I did. I did not though. Come on back and plug that new AI into this crap silo. It's gonna go the way you think it will, bro. Where the hell am I? Oh god damn it! That's right! Let me out of here! We're in this together now! Ah, what have we here? The illegal firearm. You want out, citizen? It's gonna cost you. I ain't paying you crap! Actually, that's all I can pay you right now. <laughs> Calling in backup. Code 2589, man on a crapper. We got some primo extortion targets here. Oh boy. Yeah, I mean, you did put a dirty cop chip in there. What'd you expect? And to be fair, honest, just. It took a clean cop. Trying to take all headshots, but it's just not my day. There we go. I've been playing non-stop since four in the morning, and currently it is four in the afternoon. So that's a 12-hour play session so far. Had to get to Vault Hunter Plus mode to the area where I like to do all my gun tests for my other channel's videos, because I was sick of doing it in mayhem mode and having to re-roll for modifiers that didn't affect the gun, so I could have objective reviews of them all. Did not expect me to take six seven hours to get there break the septic tank i got you okay oh it smells so good oh actually does damage that's hilarious dead blew to bits good luck bro this ain't gonna go the way you think it is oh boy what a mess i can't possibly clean this on my own i'm in over my head here Yo, Bop, let me out of here, then you and your buddies can clean out this crap box all you want. I appreciate your confidence, citizen, but this is beyond my abilities. Your feces is a level 27 biohazard. I can't risk contamination. Let me out! All beaker pods are equipped with self-guided sequences. See if we can photo mode this. All of its beauty. It's not gonna do dialogue I hope one I there. Have enough Flame. to get to mainline waste processing. What's going on? Blast off! Bye bye, bro. Three, two, one. No, 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 no! You didn't see that one coming. Huh. I wonder where he went. I want that gun. True, we did want that gun. But anyways, guys, on that note, I think I was a little bit better this time. I didn't talk too much. You guys will have to let me know in the comments. I'm trying to get better at these and know what to do, what not to do for Let's Plays. It'd be great. You just got to feel it out. I really appreciate you being here. It means a whole lot. You know, obviously, I got a playlist of all my other Let's Plays. So if you like this one, check that out. If you just like Borderlands 3 content in general, I have all the guns I could possibly imagine and want in gear over on DigFig University. So you should check that out. And I will see you guys in the next video. DigFig out. Yeah.